Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Alice's Kitchen. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for supporting us. If you haven't subscribed, please click the bell so you don't miss out on any of our recipes. So today, we are going on a different journey. I am not baking, but I'm making something very yummy and it's a big hit in winter. I am making slow cooked pork ribs. How exciting is that? Yummy, delicious. And this one saves you time because you don't have to stick around just pop them in your slow cooker, go off to work, shopping, wherever you want to go, and then you come back and check when you're ready. So stay tuned for the directions. The ingredients that we've got for our slow cooked ribs, we've got two cups of barbecue sauce, we've got a quarter cup of brown sugar, we've got three teaspoons of dried oregano leaves, we've got two teaspoons of salt and just black pepper to taste, we've got one teaspoon of Worcester sauce, one teaspoon cayenne paper and we've got four tablespoons of apple cider vinegar we're making our sauce to marinate the ribs we've got um, our barbecue sauce add brown sugar add apple cider vinegar add dried oregano leaves add Worcester sauce add cayenne pepper add your salt and black pepper and you just need to mix this together you can use a fork or anything i'm just using a mixer i've got my slow cooker dish here and i'm just going to add the ribs i've got just over a kilo so you add and then you just want to pour the sauce over don't pour all of it because it's meant to be layered. Then I'll add the next one. And then I'll pour some sauce over as well. And then another one. And I'll pour over some sauce. And then I'm adding the last one. over just pour a bit but make sure to leave a bit of sauce because after they're slow cooked you will put them in the oven for a few minutes to brown and that's when you brush with the remaining sauce so you can see that I've left a little bit here Good. so I've got my dish there I'll just cover it and you're supposed to cook them on slow or low heat for eight hours but i recommend checking after six hours because you don't want them to overcook since you're going to pop them in the oven for a little bit so now we are going to switch it on to low and i'm just gonna leave it to cook and i'll be back in six hours with an update and to show you the next step so don't go away stay tuned Now our ribs are ready, they've been slow cooking for 8 hours, I'm just transferring them onto the tray for the oven because I want to make them brown so I'm just going to brush them with barbecue sauce and I'll put them in the oven for a few minutes. Now we have brushed with barbecue sauce, we'll just pop them in the oven. 